Scoliosis is nothing but a sideways curvature of your spine, simply called a bent spine. And it is very common spine problem that affects our children. Though the children with cerebral palsy, muscular dystrophy and those with birth, bone or gene defects can develop scoliosis as they grow. But if you look at most cases of childhood scoliosis, the cause is still unknown. That is what we call as idiopathic. When the curve is very small, it is a painless condition, but it affects the children's self-conscious and self-image. When the curve grows and it gets bigger and stiffer, it can affect the or it can reduce the space available for your lungs and heart to function. Because when the curve is severe, the space in the chest gets reduced. How do we detect? whether our children has got scoliosis or not. If you ask them to stand against a wall, facing towards the wall, you can see whether they have any uh, uneven or asymmetry in the shoulder levels or in the hip levels or there is any asymmetry in the waist crease or whether they have any prominence of the shoulder blades or whether they have any hump when they bend forward. So, these are the signs to pick up the scoliosis. Once you pick up the scoliosis, if it is early, when the curve is mild, we can monitor the child or we can treat the child with a brace. Scoliosis is not curable with the brace, but we can keep it under control. The ideal treatment is the surgery. When picked up early, when the curve is flexible, surgery is simple and straightforward with a good enhanced recovery. And if you are concerned that your child may have some signs of scoliosis, get it checked with a specialist, cure the problem and the child can stand tall with self-confidence and self-respect.